<laughs> it seems as if our <laughs> it seems as if our sports experience the last two days has been totally different. Oh last night, dude. What a night. It was a night of fodder. Oh what happened? What happened? So much data fodder online. Catch me up. We may be getting to the finish line here, Leroy. We we got three team trades. We got the Suns involved. We got Aiton getting flipped to the Trailblazers. James Jones maybe doing us a solid. Damian Lillard saying goodbye to Blazers fans on Twitter. Hey. Hey. Hmm? <laughs> I don't want to toot my own horn. But what did I tell you two months ago? You said it would be closer to camp. You did say it would be closer to camp. Who knew Cron was so lazy? It's not that. Apparently the guy it's wants not, to go to it, Here. The pressure, and here's what you have to understand. The pressure doesn't build on the heat. Because you're looking at the heat and, and the talent that they have and the young talent they have, they're like, eh, well, let's run it back if it don't work, right? Yeah, it doesn't work. We're heat culture. Right. Well, there will be if, no drama. If you look around, there's other player, other teams that could use some of the pieces on this team, right? The problem is, is if you're running Portland, oh. right? You're the only person in all of this that comes out looking bad if they go into camp and Dame Lillard shows up there. It was a very interesting night, Leroy. I wish you were me because if you enjoyed uh, NBA trade buzz as much as I did, it was quite the sight to see all of uh, Blazers Twitter kind of wave the white flag. And there were, you know, there were some who were like, let's make peace, Heat Nation. And we're like, no, no peace. We know what you said. We know what you said. Again. And now they're saying they're ironic. Hide, they're hoping. Isn't it ironic that you were wearing your hat hmm. and glasses and well and uh so, uh and pipe Yar. all around the same time I have been telling you this would happen. Two months ago. Dude, but, this, 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 but here's the thing now, dude. It may be the day. Today may be the I wouldn't go to I wasn't going to sleep last. I I I was fighting it, Leroy. I went to bed last night, two in the morning. All because really? I was like, well, Portland, it's 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 not it's it's still it, possible. Business it, hours are up. It, so what if it happens? I don't want to miss it. Are you sure it wasn't because your internet crapped out and you were hoping that it would it would be fixed? No, my internet didn't crap out till this morning. Oh, oh, when you got up? Yeah. And you still made it all the way to wow. Well, I was up doing internet stuff. I was like, oh. That, that, oh, that. so you were on the internet and then it crapped out. Hmm? Oh, my goodness. Who's, who the hell else in South Florida is on the internet when you were? Oh, I don't know. It's, that happens all the time. Where they're just like, uh, service in your area. Really? Oh, yeah. That never happens to you? Not. I mean, uh, usually hey. what happens to you is your lawnmower guy, your lawn guy hey. just comes there and snips your connection. Let me tell you something. If I see an AT&T truck and you know, you know they doing some work when they pull up with the little tent, right? They, they setting up shop with the cooler and everything. Yeah, I would go out there, and I say, "Hey, man, hey, I'm doing my radio show oh, man, from ten God. to two, and I do not and will not allow you to turn and service my internet because my internet is working fine right now." So, and I break it down, and they go. Let's go do the other area first. That's it. Because they're going to be in the development all day. Man, what a day. Yes. Some yes. headlines brought to you by the new Palmetto Ford Truck Super Center. Why buy a truck at a car store? Palmetto Ford? We know trucks. I noticed so, you didn't respond to my video. I mean, what, why? Who, me? Yeah, you didn't put it. You didn't because, retweet it. You didn't repost it. You didn't because, because here's call why. me an idiot. I don't understand here's, why. Here's why. That's what I, I, that's what I take. I responded, why? Right? Like, here, I don't understand mm -hmm. why mm -hmm. you're getting so excited. The day, oh, hold on. Hold, let me finish before you go. Like, dude, you know what you are? Vlad, this dude is like the wild horse when they put him in the gate to run the race. And he's yeah, he bucking around like he can't. I'm like, look, I'm 
squirt him on the back of that. Whoa, buddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He, he just won't, he won't stop. So, like, right now I'm stroking Tobin. Tobin, Tobin, here's the deal. You knew this was going to happen. It doesn't matter. Like, it's like, so the excitement. When you, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Happen, Are you, we, this is not a surprise. Are you not excited when a new yes. Avengers hits theaters? Are you yes, not excited for movie day? Of course, but it's I haven't seen them. Like, like, here's yeah, why. Whatever. Here's why, oh, Dave. Here's why. Too? Here's why. Here's why, Vlad. Here's why I get excited because I haven't seen the movie. I don't know what's going to happen. Okay. Right. You know. You this knew gonna this was going to happen. Nah. Why? Because the player said he's only coming to Miami. I mean, he just recently said it on the. On right. the podcast, it is what it is. Nah, it, here's the thing. Like, even when LeBron came to Miami, there was a lot of fodder the day that he was here. People were oh, like, oh, there's a hotel no. party set up. Until it happened, you didn't know. Until it happened, wait, you wait, weren't wait. quite sure. You here's weren't quite sure. When when he said, okay, here, when he did that show, mm -hmm. and he said, I'm taking my talents mm -hmm. to South Beach, mm -hmm. then there could have been an eruption because you that was the exciting part of it. Yeah, but there right? was a, but, but to your but I'm telling you, there was a lot of Miami's talk and chatter that week. Like there was a lot of talk of the Stephen A. Smith reported it. A lot of people right. were reporting that he was going to Miami, but like nobody really believed it till it happened. Okay. But Damian Lillard, I get you. It's a little less drama, but it's still amazing because it's Damian Lillard, dude. I understand. <laughs> I, here. I, I, man, listen. Vlad. Jimmy Bam and Damon. Scratch the fire. Jimmy Bam and Damon. <laughs> hey, hey, Bam and Damon. Scratch, scratch the fire. Wait a minute. Time out. Are you? This guy's moving. He's dancing. Jimmy the yeah. shoulders. Look at him. No, that's Jimmy look. Bam. That's that's intangible dance right there. Oh, the the old chair dance. dance. Yeah. I tell you, it's not if, intangible. If feet are really. Hey, if feet are required, that dancing ends real quick. Damian but Lewis. Dame gave Tobin rhythm. <laughs> So look, I understand your excitement. Hell, I'm excited too to see this how this is gonna work, right? <laughs> but but the only reason why I'm not as excited or overdoing it like you is because how excited can you be about the dude say I'm only gonna play for Miami? And then when it happens, yeah, there's some excitement there. It finally oh, happens. I, I know. But wait, 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 hold on. Here's the other thing. Here's the other thing. You getting excited. About one side of this. You understand? Mm -hmm. You don't care. You mm -hmm. got Dame. You don't care. <laughs> oh, are again. you not gonna be are you not gonna be upset or disappointed at who they trade? Hard to say. Oh my I don't know. We'll hey, see. hey Vlad, this guy, you know what your new nickname should be? Shiny new thing. This is the thing though. Like, I don't know That's what, what you Maybe we get Damon and we keep Jovic. Maybe we get Damon and we keep Tyler Hero. We don't know. Who knows? I, but that's my point. Who knows? You, but listen. Again, you, try, you don't wait, wait, wait. excitement. There are surprises. Tobes, Tobes you my guy. But mm -hmm. I see the angle you're taking. You trying to be excited or whatever. It don't matter. As long as it ain't banning me, you ain't going to get upset about whoever's out. That's very true. That's very true. Okay. There's whatever, okay, stop, whatever act, happens. Stop, stop acting like hard to say or whatever. whatever happens. You, the fact of the matter is, is you don't care. I want Dave. If I end today, if you told me that today happens and the Heat don't have Tyler, Caleb, Nico, and Jaime Jaquez and don't have picks till the next decade, but I have Damian Lillard with Jimmy and Bam. <laughs> but wait, but wait, you know, one of the, one of the strengths one of the strengths of the Heat mm -hmm. is having some resemblance of depth. See, if you do that with two guys I'm... damn near in their mid thirties, you're mm -hmm. asking for you're asking for it. No, you're fine. You're you fine. just are. So let me ask you this then: mm -hmm. Did you think Kyle Lowry was talking to Chauncey Billups at that Colorado Colorado State game to let him know like what the yeah where are you gonna buy me out? Where am yeah. I going? Yeah. Well, you do because I feel, yeah, definitely. You think Lowry's being included in his deal? Hard to say. I don't know. That's a good question. That was kind of no, weird, wait. though. Dude, hey. Vlad, mm -hmm. don't believe this man. This oh, man right here is right now right in let's his pocket. His in his pocket, he got a he got a package, right? Yeah, okay. And number one hey, on hey. that 
we be throwing in uh, Kyle Lowry. Yeah. Right? And Nurkic uh, goes to Phoenix. We get Dame Dalla. How did the wheel actually look like a phone? <laughs> Perfectly curved. Nyar. Uh, Leroy's frozen. Oh, is he? Well, that's a shame. Oh, I'm back. Oh, there he is. Hello. Okay. Hey, so, look. He got to listen in his pocket. And you know what's number one on this? Seems like he made fun of my internet. And it like, uh, look at this. It's like, oh, yeah. I'm to get him. They got him. Spe- they got Spectre him. AT&T got him. Uh, AT&T's like, watch this, Leroy Horde. We're going we're gonna to freeze you up today. Oh, I know. Leroy. Yeah. What's going on, baby? So I just want you to. Just... Are you? You're going to be upset if Nico's gone. That's what's going to happen if Jovich is gone. That's going to upset you. It, it's not. The only reason why it would upset me is because I've always been very intrigued by his skill set, mm-hmm. and I want to see it play out a little bit. The mm-hmm. fact that I won't get that opportunity to see it play out, it hurt. It I'm gonna hurt. be a little bit disappointed, even though I get it right. Of but, course, dude. If I got to watch him for the next ten. 12 years, right? I mean, you got to tell me it's going not going to sting a little bit. Well, good thing he's on the West Coast. Why? I'll be oh. able to sleep through it. Oh, my goodness. See, <laughs> see this dude fun. has contingency plans for all of his letdowns. That's right, I do. Anyway, so yesterday, here's where the goosey started. So yesterday. In Can the- we get a timeline? What time? Yeah, so yesterday, I'd say like around dinner time, you know, around six, six-ish, yep. this dude from uh, from Arizona, John Lindoro. Who? Rando? No. No, you, not a Rando. You, you tend to follow anybody follow that everybody. gives you the information that you want. I follow everybody. But, okay. I mean, like with the internet, when the, when the info finds itself, the info finds itself. So this guy, John Gambadoro, has been doing radio there for a long time. And he's got sauces. He's got, uh, especially within the Suns, right? He's very tied in with the Suns. He was one of the people that was like, you know, this whole Bradley Beal thing, it's a one-team thing. There's no there's no uh, heat. They're not even interested in Bradley Beal. So, you know, he's gotten some stuff right. So he says yesterday, he goes on his uh, radio program, and he says, probably within the next 24 hours, I'm expecting a Damian Lillard trade. This was also around the time where Windhorst was on some podcast, and he was like, the trailblazers have been moving a lot heavy over the last couple of days. They want this done before training camp. All right. So they want this done. and they of want course. the drama out. And they want the drama out of the way. I, uh, uh, who knew? Listen, don't don't hurt your shoulder patting yourself on the back, dude. Who knew? Point four I'm just saying. Guys, the guy's so proud of himself. Can't even enjoy the party. Uh, enjoy the party. I, you know what, Tobin? When you're right. Oh, you have a party party. I, mean, I know, but like he's not even having a fun party. He goes, no, I told you. Man. That's like, if you're right, like have fun with it. Anyway, so what? If I did it, if I responded the way you did, I'd be you. And if I, mean, I was, God help us all. Could you imagine a black you going around the, the South Florida? I don't know how to answer that. <laughs> <laughs> uncomfortable so um so yeah the suns blazers and heat apparently they got into a three-way talk they're talking about a deal that apparently is going to land Aiton in portland that's the talks of it and of course get damian Lillard. so in this case i guess the the, the trailblazers are going to end up with a piece they desire more than tyler hero here's the thing that was interesting somebody mentioned during the chat and they said, now I don't know if Tyler Hero's in the trade. We don't know. We don't know really what the pieces are. It's, it's really we don't know who what heat players are in the in right. the, involved in this. We don't. And somebody mentioned I lost you on the chat, but he goes, I think KD likes Duncan Robinson. Actually, I'm pretty sure KD has a solid relationship with Tyler. And Tyler's basketball idol, strangely enough, is Devin Booker. And that yeah. made me think, like, what if Tyler Hero ends up on Phoenix? God, that's not. That's not good. That's a scary ass. No, team. that's not good. That's not good. <laughs> I, I don't think that works because they so already we got, have like. So nine. you're gonna bring you're gonna so you're gonna go Tyler at point guard, book at two. Probably have to go. Yeah, no, somebody's two. gonna have to play a three. You'd have to have Devin Booker be the shooting is the small forward. Yeah, because KD's gonna play the four, and I don't even know. KD who's the play four, the five. and then they probably get Nurkic as the center. Yeah. 
Yeah. Tyler can light it up though, dude. He's he's the best. He's yeah, I mean, but they'll be but you book and 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 Tyler be your two guards. Yeah. So then what happens to Beal? Nah, Beal's got to be the point guard. Then I guess Tyler, no, I mean, no, you need to, you basically need you're playing a three guard. You'd have lineup. to basically a three guard lineup. That's basically what it'd be. They're gonna get with killed KD on the being boards. there with KD being their power. Yeah, but they're probably 140 points a game. Who who plays defense? I don't know if that's gonna happen. I'm just saying I know, but <laughs> wait, 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 wait. As of right now. Nothing has happened, so we can do this. I'm just saying, if Tyler Hero, that's what with it, baby. I'm just saying, that's what with it. That's what you would say. It doesn't make me fun. That's scary. And plus, honestly, if, Ty- if there was a place Tyler Hero would want to get traded, I would say a team with KD and uh, his favorite player Devin Booker would probably be a place he would want to get traded to. But I don't even know if he's in the trade. He might be staying here. I don't know. It does. Now that you mentioned it, now thinking about they, they also have Bradley Beal. Isn't it going to be funny though if Tyler Hero does get traded to Phoenix in in some kind of flip? If that did happen how much people would go from saying Tyler Hero sucks to, oh, my God, this is the scariest lineup of all time. It'd be interesting. Offensively. Offensively. Of course, of course. But, well, yeah, because he goes from being a number two to being a number four. Yeah. But, well, he's three here. But he does he's take the three, most three, but then with that first, that second unit, he's one. Oh, so you think he goes there and becomes a sixth man? I don't, I don't, I don't, you're going to be, Did man. get Eric Gordon? He's 100. Yeah. Yeah, You'll be hard pressed. That's what I'm saying. It, this do, it doesn't seem likely that he would end up there. Uh, Barry Jackson reported last night after no contact with the Heat for weeks. Blazers are now taking Lillard conversations seriously. Heat has patiently waited, knowing Lillard trade is uh, is clear Eminent. avenue to take him to another level. Uh, clear avenue to take them to another level. He said, uh, "When or whether they strike a deal, we'll see." But Portland seems more eager for a resolution before camp, if their wishes can be satisfied. And then he finishes it off. And to all a good night. I guess that was Barry's uh, flare gun to everybody that they could go to sleep. That was at 1.44 a.m. I was still up. <laughs> of course you were. Was t- How, the much, the- question. How much coffee have you had? Today? Just yeah. one cup. But okay. I, got two well, Cosmos- Celsius? I got two Cosmo Celsius in the freezer, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Ready for a refuel. Hey, man, what is wrong so, but this was the thing. So here's the thing, though, that mattered the most. Okay. okay. All, the water, okay. all that stuff. That was cool. But here's what happened, Leroy. Mm-hmm. Damian Lillard yesterday on his Twitter account, mm-hmm. Damian Lillard responds to this Blazers account, right? Mm-hmm. And the account is called uh, Blazers for Real. And it just simply said, when all this was going on, it said, I love you, Damian Lillard. And Damian Lillard responded. And he goes, ditto, brother. Wait, dude, you too much, too much. What do you mean? Too much. That's too goodbye, much. dude. He just responded that is to good random. Line. No, it's not. That's goodbye, dude. That's he just goodbye. responded then, to the comments. Nah, he doesn't respond. All he's been doing is promoting his album. Of course, he responds to the comments. Nah, get out of here. And then, if you go look right now, Vlad, go look at Damian Lillard's likes on Twitter. It's like all sad, Rip City forever with a Damian Lillard mural. Love Damian Lillard. Portland loves you forever, Dame. It's all goodbye stuff. That's all he's liking. I, on Twitter. I tell you what. Like I said before, there is no way Cronin can come out of this looking good. No. Based on how he's handled. I don't care who they're he gonna gets They're going to turn back. on him bad. Yeah. I don't care who he gets back, right? If he would have came out and said, I understand what Dame you know, wants to do. We're going to try to accommodate him. We would like to try to get as much as possible, right? Everybody would have understood that, right? That's business, right? But you're going to accommodate Dane, right? But when you come out with the nonsense that he's come out with the last few months, oh, maybe we, we're trying to build the best team possible and da, 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 and just, just disregarding what Dame, the conversations him and Dame had, mm-hmm. right? And then say, "Me, oh, we cool with Dame, we cool. Then Dame had to respond. That don't go over well with your fan base. Yeah. They look like you look like a clown. You look like you're playing games. Yeah, you look like a clown. Lewis right. says uh, the Suns want Caleb and his salary. That makes a lot of sense for them to want him because they need a guy who kind of just does everything. Right. I got to give you credit, Tobin. Mm-hmm. I looked in Twitter. Mm-hmm. I looked on Twitter. Yep. Pat Riley's trending. Mm-hmm. What's the first video you see? Let me show Pat Riley is trending. Oh, you got you got. Vlad teasing you. Oh my goodness. <laughs> First video that comes up. <sighs> it's him. 
It's him. <laughs> oh, really? He's the first thing you see. It's Tobin. Look, it's Tobin because I'm looking. I'm like, all right, let me check the Dane Lillard. Let me see. So I'm like, let's see what's trending. I'm like, why is Pat Riley trending? First, so you click on it. First video you see. Roll, roll, roll your boat gently down the stream. Pat Riley, Pat Riley, Pat Riley, Pat Riley, get Dame to my team. <laughs> Listen. Oh, my God. The people, like what, the people like what they like. The people like what they like. I can't help it, Leroy. But what's amazing is if you were at home, you would have more props. I saw it. He texted to me. <laughs> no, but I'm sure. Would appreciate a retweet, Leroy. You know? uh, a re- I did listen. Here's what I did. I looked at it and I responded, "Why?" Because <laughs> you know. <laughs> I always wonder what my neighbors think when they hear me doing this kind of stuff. You know what? This show should literally be a cartoon. <laughs> it should be animated, right? Because nobody would ever believe real people do this crap. Yeah. Like who like first of all, what grown ass man gonna go out back and play Fruit Ninja? Mm-hmm. Or sink uh sink another man in a, a large garbage can uh margarita. It need to be a cartoon. That's right. Uh, 